offered to your attention the report on the architecture of built-in self-test and recovery memory chips by authors Andrianto Vladimir, Momar Daya, Ryamtsa Vladimir, Wakina Hadiana. Abstract. The problem of increase of the technical readiness of memory chips are considered. The architecture of built-in self-test and repair is proposed, what allows changing of the data of the primary array of memory cells, in which the failure has occurred, on the data coming from the outputs of array of backup memory cells. The proposed hardware and software provide automatic reconfiguration of the data upon detection failure of chip by the application of critical systems, providing control of nuclear power plants and other energy facilities, aircraft, ships and ground vehicles, increased requirements to ensure their working condition. To meet this requirement is necessary to increase the coefficient of technical readiness whose value increases with decreasing recovery time control system in case of failure of its constituent units. Introduction The main components of control systems critical applications are memory devices that store the program and used in the performance of control algorithms. The main memory is one of the most reliable components of computer because the producers of memory modules are carefully tested their product before it hits the market and ready products. However, in memory chips, due to static electricity, electrons migrate from the high conductivity of the oxides, the tunnel effect, etc. over time. There may be failures and faults due to the instability of the charges. If the test found inefficient units, they should be replaced by serviceable. However, you spend time searching for the same memory module and to check the validity of timings the value of which is specified in the SPD. Significant time spent on the restoration of systems may lead to irreparable consequences for the application of critical systems. Memory type ECC error check and correction error correction code is able to automatically correct any single error and detect any double. As long as the memory is functioning more or less normal, the confrontation of entropy and anti-interference codes is decided in favor of the latter. However, in full or partial outlet of one or more memory modules of the system, corrective powers of control codes is not enough memory and starts to work very unstable. Purpose and Objectives The purpose of this work improving the reliability of memory devices by restoring the working state of the memory after the occurrence of failure resulting in an unavailable state of one of the bits of data by making repairs to the built-in self-test and repair. To achieve this purpose it is necessary to solve the following tasks. To develop a block diagram of memory chip with built-in self-test and recovery. To develop the method of reconfiguration data bits for the chip, which has M formation bits of data. On this slide shows the typical structure of the built-in self-test tools of memory. When you modify the built-in self-test architecture is necessary to ensure rapid switching of the test process and the normal operation of the chip. The degree of coverage of possible failure should increase with increasing period of operation of chip, while the hardware costs should be as small as possible, so as not to greatly increase the cost of implementing the new architecture. On slide number 7 shows the typical structure of the memory chips with integrated built-in self-test and built-in redundancy analysis tools. Usually provides for the repair of a few lines and or columns of memory cells, however, the redundancy increases the area of the crystals, which reduces the yield of effective products. If provided for replacement of cells is not enough, we have to reduce the storage capacity. This leads to a decrease in the productivity of the entire system, which is unacceptable for critical applications. On this slide presents the structure of the memory chips with built-in multi-version self-test. On slide number 9 presents, the block diagram of memory chip with built-in self-test and recovery. On slide number 10 presents the structures of reconfigurator's input and output data. On slide number 11 shows the format of micro-commands and micro-operations. On slide number 12 shows the algorithms of tests, March C10 and cycles, Hammer 49 and cycles. Method of reconfiguration data bits. Consider the process of reconfiguration data bits for the chip, which has M information bits of data. Information bits of data compose a set. 
where DI, data bits of the primary cell array, DR, a data bit of the backup cell array. The cells of primary and backup arrays are tested built in self-test, as a result of the error vector is formed, where EI, the error vector of data bit of the primary cell array, ER, the result of testing backup cell array. Consider the case where a failure of the backup components array cell is detected, ER, equal 1, then reconfigurators provide the following formation mode of data. At the same chip recovery is impossible, but it continues to work properly. A detection failure of components of 0 bit of the primary cell array, the following transformations are performed. A detection failure of any components of the IS bit of the primary cell array I not equal 0, the following transformations are performed. This method of reconfiguration of the data recovery circuit after the failure does not require complex algorithms. Determine the address of the row or column of a failed cell primary cell array and find the row or column address backup cell array to implement change. This reduces the runtime recovery of the semiconductor chip memory. Restoration of working capacity chip is possible only in case of failure of components of one bit data. Summary Techno-economic benefits from the use of a memory chip with a proposed architecture of built-in self-test and recovery is achieved by increasing the rate of technical readiness by restoring operating state after the occurrence of failure as the memory arrays can be used dynamic random access memory, static random access memory, or any other memory which is a structured array of storage elements. References Thank you for your attention.